guys, so I will be reviewing a few products for you today and I will be reviewing a company that goes by the name of Madison Street Beauty. I'm sure you guys have heard about them. You can find them on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, basically the whole night. Before actually getting into the products themselves, I just wanted to talk about the company real quick. So all their products are natural and vegan and I think that is really really good especially for people with sensitive skin. Their products are handmade here in the US and Las Vegas actually and that's kind of funny because I just came from there this weekend. Their customer service was amazing. I talked to a couple of different people and they were really fast to respond when I had questions. They were really really nice and they helped me out with everything. Shipping was super fast which I really love. I wasn't even expecting it to get that fast. It only took a few days from ordering. But anyway, I picked out a lot of eyeshadows, a concealer, and also a lip product. So if you guys are interested in what I think about these things, then just keep on watching. So I guess I'll just start with the eyeshadows because that is what I picked most of. I think I probably have like five to six eyeshadows that I picked out. They had such a variety of colors that I had such a hard time picking, but there was a few that kind of stand out to me, and that's why I picked them out. The colors are super pigmented and easy to apply. The only thing that I do have a problem with is since they are pigments and they do look like powder basically, they do have a lot of fallout so I suggest that you do your foundation after you do your eyes if you are using their eyeshadows. Electric Periwinkle. This is Atlantis. Cherry Blossom. Fuchsia. Honey Gold. And last but not least, Emerald. concealer is pretty much part of my daily routine that I do every day when I do my makeup and I seem to have a problem with creasing in this area with the liquid so I do like to set it with my foundation but I do seem to see fine lines and things settling in there throughout the day so I decided to try out their concealer and this one is just in their brightening formula and I absolutely love it it went on so smoothly and I actually did not see creasing creasing for a good five hours I want to say and since it is getting into the colder seasons, I feel like we should be keeping our lips really moisturized, so that is why I decided to try out a lip product. And I actually decided to try out a lip sheer by them. So I actually decided to try a darker color just because it is coming to these cold seasons and I feel like berry colors are perfect for the fall and the winter time. I decided to try out a shade in the name of Cerise. Some of the things that really stand out to me is palm oil, shea butter, organic coconut oil and I think organic is way better than just coconut oil cocoa butter and also vitamin E and that is just a few of the great things that they have in these lip shears so these lip shears are actually beeswax lip balms which makes them super super moisturizing I'm really not sure why I have such a problem saying that but the only thing that I have a problem with is the smell of this thing it actually smells like straight up old-fashioned lipstick but I guess the scent can get used to after a while wear them alone for a light wash of color but you can also use them as a base for other lipsticks so those are all the things that I decided to pick out from their website to try out and hopefully this review was helpful and informative for you guys and I really really hope that you guys can check out some of their products they are really affordable and of course you can never go wrong with vegan or 100% natural products so that I definitely would take advantage of. So I'll have their website and other links where you can reach them down below and I will talk to you guys later. Bye! Excuse me. Now you must do the shame. And just... <laughs> so just... Just so that you can get an idea. So just that. So just... How are you supposed to say that? <sighs> Make all their products. Look, say hi. You want to be interrupted, but you don't want to say hello? That's so rude. I actually decided to pick up a darker. So the, so these lip shears are actually 100% natural, and they are bee wax. And they are bee wax lip based. These are actually bee wax lip balms, so they make it super pig. No. These lip shears are actually 100% natural, as I mentioned, as a... Um, Mm. Shh. Shh, 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 shh. 
East Wax Lip Balm. I'm not sure why I can't say that. 